Welcome back YouTubers. Okay now. In this follow up we'll make um, what we're going to do in this follow up. Um Alright. Okay now. Uh, here's a simple part. Whenever a manager or a anchor data anchor make an entry or a quantity what are they going to do as soon as it passes the rate by entering its value uh, automatically total amount will be updated with the quantity times rate value you following I mean like uh, quantity multiplied by rate is equals to total amount in this box and you can and the data entry manager can change it as well as its printing and after making an advance after making an advance entry as soon as it will be it, it will done with its advance entry automatically this balance label will be updated with the total amount subtracted by the advance amount that's all for this follow up okay so now how will it be achieved okay so it's very simple now select this numeric box right click select properties go to this thunderbolt type icon events select value change second last value double click it and it will make an event handler automatically for you now over here what we have to do is very simple as soon as its value will be changed th this quantity will be multiplied by this value and equals to this total amount so how mm, yeah double click an event handler make a variable called a which is equals will equals to a simple is that now, uh, whenever the data enter will make it, er, will make an entry for an advance. As soon as it is, as soon as he will be finished by entering an advance entry. Mm, yeah, advance value will be my subtracted from total amounts value. So double click on advance or right click on properties. Go to Thunderbolt. Double click value chain property and yeah here you are an automated generated event make a variable same called a and total txt yeah amount dot value my subtracted by and then lbl balance as balance is an string property string controller string container wait yeah uh, so we have to convert or cast a which is an and the decimal property which will contain a decimal property to an uh, string that's all we'll run it okay quantity 1000 rate multiply by 100 per each you following total amount automatically gets multiplied and given and changes its value from 0 to this 1 to 3 4 5 okay now advance 5000 and here's a balance property balance value that's all for today i hope you enjoyed thank you and see you tomorrow